Hi, it's me, Habibi from ZofiaKreasi.com. Previously, in my sec in my second video tutorial, I I've shown you how to fix the uppercase and lowercase problem from for this uh, search input. Here, if I type Habibi in uppercase and lowercase, there is no difference but uh, I will make some changes that previously I add this two line of code this is the first line I've added on my previous tutorial and this is the second I will make it more efficient by putting this lower two lowercase here entire text dot to lowercase and also here search text dot to lowercase and then we don't need this line of code anymore let me delete this line now we have fewer line lines of code and the functionality is still same I can type in lowercase and it shows the result and also if I type in uppercase it shows the result this is uh, for fixing my previous code but here in this third video tutorial what I'm going to do is instead of showing uh, an alert you see if I click this find button an alert we can see the alert after that what I'm going to do is to replace this alert with highlighting with the highlighted result instead of that alert browser or JavaScript should highlight the exactly the exact text in this paragraph element it should highlight the search result how should I do that here I will add a new line of code then I will access this entire text variable I will copy this I will this I'll copy this variable here entire text no first I'm going to create a temporary variable for temp text temp text should be entire text dot to lower case and that dot and dot replace brackets and this function needs two parameters first is the first is the search text here search text but in lower case search text dot lower case to lower case and the second parameter is now this uh, the second parameter is also the search text dot to lower case it is same but we have to add some we have to ha add something I will add something before and after this second parameter let me expand it here in this is second parameter for replace function in this second parameter I will make I will add a string 
and this string is an HTML element span and I will style it style background color yellow okay and then I will close that span tag here I will here is the closing tag of that of that span. Now, this temp text variable contains contains entire text of that paragraph element, but with uh, this span element and this span element is styled it has yellow color for the background then I will change the content of this paragraph element with this temp text variable now here I will call now here I will type document dot get element by ID so, uh, my text this is my text and I will replace this text with new text this new text is temp text with the yellow span dot inner html equal to temp text that's it let's test how does this code works how does this code work if I type name and click find oh there is an error entire text that to lowercase that replace is not a function in line 15 entire text oh I forgot to put this uh, brackets uh, and also here brackets uh, save it and let's test it again I type name and click find uh, not a number is here is the mistake I have to delete this additional plus sign now let's test it again name find now this name is highlighted in yellow let me delete this alert line we don't need the alert anymore you see the result is now highlighted is my you see that this highlighting function works but the problem the next problem appears the problem is entire text is changed to completely lowercase text maybe we don't we, we don't want that it is not cool I think so this is a problem and we have to solve it but at least now we can highlight the search result by adding this single by add, by adding these two lines of code now uh, for solving this problem this lowercase text 
I will solve it on next tutorial and just watch my next tutorial and I will show you how to fix it for now it is pretty good I can type a text and find it the result is highlighted in yellow you can change the color red for example is okay thank you for watching this tutorial and see you next time